Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name is David and this is a deck review. Hey, today we're gonna look at the new signature Nox, the Snow Leopards from the Blue Crown and House of Playing Cards. All right, so what is the theme behind the Snow Leopard deck? Uh, the Snow Leopard deck was made to commemorate the Nox signature series and how rare they are. All these cards typically uh, become extinct quote unquote. I mean, they sell out, right? So this is a rare uh, brand of cards. So this makes it a rare deck and they decided to release a rare color. And so I think all that comes together uh, by calling them the snow leopards, which is kind of uh, almost uh, the color of the tuck and the back. It's not snow, you know, it's not snow, it's not white, but it's a, it's a goldish uh, hue that kind of looks white. So whether you want these cards for magic, or, or for cardistry, I think the Snow Leopards will definitely pop out. Originally, the Snow Leopards came out at Christmas time. Uh, Alex Pandrea said that if you spent a certain amount of money uh, on the Blue Crown, then these would be added to your cart. Uh, however, a lot of people didn't like that. They wanted to have access to them without spending a big chunk of change. And so recently, uh, Blue Crown released these uh, with a dollar amount. And of course, they quickly sold out and now they are gone. The front of the tech case is this soft muted gold and then it has gold uh, metallic accents it says snow leopards and knock right here on the front and of course because it's expert it's a side loading tuck the bottom of the tuck case has some ad copy about the blue crown and expert and other than that uh, there's really nothing else to it that is pretty much it for the tuck case let's take a look at these cards these cards are printed from the expert playing card company and uh, they are very thick so if you've ever held a knock card before you know it has a thick feel and it has a very slick surface to them so if i take 10 of these and put them into a caliper for you if i measure them for you to let you know how thick they are and then compare them to other decks maybe a deck you've held before maybe a deck you own already can kind of give you an idea uh, but if you've had the knock before they're gonna look and feel like other knock decks uh, 10 of these in the caliper comes to 2.90 2.90 is the same thickness as the denim cards from down to dave uh, the grinders the artifice deck and the draconian deck the back design is a solid field of i'm gonna call it gold muted gold but it has the black edge border that makes them a knock version 3's signature series right so it's s knock 3's or knock 3 s's however you want to call it the other interesting thing about the knock 3 s's is that they are fully marked uh, the knock 3's in the past were marked by suit the knock 3 s's are fully marked okay so with this deck you should get a, an accompanying pdf that explains how to read the back design. Be very wary about where you pick up uh, marked decks. Make sure that the seller, uh, especially if you're getting them off eBay or some other third party, uh, make sure that they're giving you the PDF so that you can read the back design as well. Your two jokers are gonna be standard knock jokers in that they say joker on the sides and it's a large black star in the center. Your ace of spades is also the standard knock ace of spades. It's a very simple pip and in the center it says minimal playing cards. Otherwise, your pips, indices, and courts are all completely standard, instantly recognizable, making them perfect for magic and gameplay. All right, so that's my review of the Snow Leopards from HOPC, Blue Crown, and Expert Playing Card Company. I picked up mine at the Blue Crown, but like I said, they're sold out now, so you might be able to find these still on eBay, or like I suggested, maybe a third party seller. As always, we ask that you like this video just so other people can find it faster. We also recommend that you subscribe to this channel just to stay up to date on the latest in cards and card magic. If you'd like to follow me on social media, you can. I'm at facebook.com slash magic orthodoxy, twitter.com slash magic orthodoxy, instagram.com slash magic underscore orthodoxy. And if you need more content, you can always find it at magic orthodoxy.com. Thanks. Bye.